Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to the Hobby Dude 007 channel. We're in Salisbury, North Carolina at the Mid-Carolina Model Car Swap Meet in Salisbury, North Carolina. Going to have some fun, do a little shopping, see who's here. And do me a favor, guys. As many of you may know, our buddy Matt Inman with Model Car Videos had surgery yesterday. Say a prayer for him for a quick recovery. Let's get him back to the workbench as quick as possible. Matt, we love you, buddy. See you soon. Let's go have some fun, guys. Okay, we're inside at the swap meet, and as you see, we have a pretty full building. There's a lot of guys here. I've already seen uh, Glenn with Herd Hobbies and uh, his awesome modified and accessories too, guys. Also got a chance to chat for a minute with Wes at Wes's Model Car Corner. A lot of independent uh, vendors some great stuff. I did a stroll through a little early and there's Fast Track Hobbies over here on the left. Lots of goodies. Well, let's get down and take a stroll. Hey guys, we're back at Herd Hobbies. Here is Glenn. Glenn, let's talk about these accessories and your new line of kits. These are great, man. Talk to us. Sure. Um, some of the new things we're, we're coming out with, uh, we're designing the, actually we got the Bain kit out. You remember the first time we did it was the Brian Lofton kit. But you can see now we're actually adding more detail into them. We're going back and doing like a 2010. We're doing different body styles. We can do different seat posts. You got your different hoods, the different vent panels. So now to try to make their model look more like their real car. So we're, we're able to change out body parts to make it look more uh, of what the people are building. I take it that's, that's what a, some of these body panels over here. These were some were. of our first ones, our first prototypes. So now I've improved on them. Here they used to have ribs in them. So now for my manufacturing, it don't, and they're they're and the panels are actually thinner and and, and more sleek now. So that was just some of my old prototypes from the early beginnings. Awesome. So and now you still got the jacks. So now we're working with jacks. We got setup stands. Uh, we even have a toolbox coming that will actually have your. Uh, wrenches your socket sets power tools uh wow. everything so it's going to have everything in it that you can actually work on a car uh with it generator is coming with it then your air hoses um right and then some of these still get over how, how small make a realistic net and you just see how small but that is wow. the real size of the real net that goes in the car. And then As I recall, you work on the real ones. Yeah, I work well. on the uh, Shady Grady racing. That's what I was thinking. Um, 3D printing, guys. Isn't that wicked? So, Check that out. So, I like to always said, we're making modifications to engines. The engines will be getting better. I'm working on a new engine that will actually have the cam, uh, the crankshaft, the pistons and everything else and then here's your setup stands um, we're going to have the engine lift uh, coming so anything that you can have it like it's sitting in the race shop uh, with it we'll have that uh, coming out with it i was looking at some of the decals a while ago too yes these, these are just and you got so many yes and these are i'm, I, I'm mostly on track, focused on the smart and the bowman gray but we're trying to get more northern drivers more I get more access to northern drivers mm -hmm. um, and then let's know a partnership I partnered up with ace decals me and Mark are working together as you can see fluorescent decals it's hard to make them in inkjet so now any fluorescent decals Mark makes the decals so they'll fit on my car or, or Wes's so we have a partnership and then we have the kits um, coming out that that they'll have the actual ace decal so I've got a right. partnership with Mark on, on the decals there. And you're also doing update accessories for Wes's kits. Yes, and if you go to the Herd Hobby uh, website, there'll be a section, and it's called Wes's Model Car Corner, and any part underneath that section would be uh, compatible with Wes's car. 
Uh, our, our tires are a little different and also the body panels. Uh, so a lot of, if you get in body wraps, I don't, they don't really work that well, but the parts, I'll start making some parts that will uh, be compatible with Wes's kit. They're like in the rims, the rotors, and calipers, and stuff right, like that. Right. I'll have those that will work with Wes's car. Awesome, awesome. Well, Glenn, always a pleasure again. Yes, Thank you so much. Uh, Thanks, good to Mark. talk to you, and we will see you soon, I'm sure. All right. Thanks, Mark. Thanks, buddy. I'm going to wait and see until somebody gets a few more tutorials here that I can work on. I don't know the thing to help you. I'm not going to buy some hair. Basically, you need a little pin device with, a, uh, with, with an 049 bit. Right. Well, I mean, he, he hasn't told me. Here with Wes of Wes's Model Car Corner. Hey, Wes, good to see you again, buddy. Hey, man, how are we today? We are doing great. Wes awesome. brought some cool stuff, but he's got something else some of you guys may not know about. Talk to us about this accessory pack for the modified. Hey, this is to make your model kit that you bought from us. If you got the uh, modified, makes you a showboater. And it's got your chrome wheels, got your chrome nerf bars, got the pictures of the nerf bars, and you got your chrome oil tank, got your chrome uh, valve covers in there. And uh, the chrome wheels, and you got an extra set of tires. It's got the Hoosier decals. So you got the extra tires and decals already in, in addition. It, it is. Yep. Twenty four ninety five, and uh, these are just some of the sample ones we had done. To make sure that we've got everything boxed and working like we need to. And they sent them to us from the plant. We got them Thursday. I put them on the show this past Thursday night, and we just brought the leftovers here today to the swap meet. And uh, next week they're in full production. So yeah, it looks like you've only got days. a few a few sets left here today. Yeah, we've been we pretty got pretty well got wiped out today. So uh, <coughs> I was going to say your table was a lot fuller than this this morning. Oh yes. Yeah. So we don't have much left, but uh, hey, we, it's been a great show. It's always a great swap meet here. Alan and the guys put on a big job, but hey, they we've do. got new kits coming, and we've got uh, a new modified coming. Fleming Family Racing's coming next, and that's got two sheets of decals. Has the white tree for the nerf bars and the wheels so you can paint the black wheels or the silver wheels and then it's also got this included in that kit oh so the accessories uh, pack is in that kit yes it has ah. the chrome tree in that uh it's uh the and it has two sheets of cardiograph decals to build either car so that car that kit is a two-in-one kit it's the only one we're going to make like that but uh we did that for the Fleming family because we would have never had been able to produce these models if it wouldn't have been for them and us being able to use their race shop and everything to uh, do the CAD design. So outstanding. That. So uh, hey, you all get a great benefit out of it as a consumer at $49.95 retail and uh, you'll love it. Yeah. yeah, I think we're looking forward to it already. All right. Well, yes. thank you, buddy. Thank you. See, See you later. Peace out. Let's get the heck out of Dodge. <clears throat> 
Paparazzi everywhere I go, paparazzi follow me around. I'm just all that. <laughs> Yeah, I don't. Okay. Facebook, something I just. <laughs> social media, I stay I know, I know what you mean. Yeah. Well, that's interesting. Yeah. That's interesting. I asked him. Yeah, so many is over there. And he get marked. So the only company that can do it. Guys, thank you. Hey, Ed. How do you I know there's a list, I think there's about three or four people on the list right now. But. 
Yeah, okay. Well, I've done the last two. It's just that, you know, uh, wait for the, you know, wait for a couple months before and then call, you know. I don't want to commit to next year because I don't know how you live in Excuse me. Oh, you're okay. See that one? Anybody remember that old Grand Prix? Well, looky here. I forgot this picture, but there is Buddy Baker's white interior to early season 71 Charger. Oh, I'm going to come back and spend some time, Dodge Magnum. Oh, yeah. Let me, let me show, finish showing you around, guys. Then we'll come back to those. There's an old AMT value pack. Four kits, 60 bucks. I think originally they were like $19.99 for four kits. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. Who is this? Mrs. Hobby Dude. Making it reasonable. 
say that uh, they already, the basis is telling you no. <laughs> Wait, this, that's not $100. Uh, <laughs> I like that. Yeah. Yeah. Say hey, Larry. Hey, how you out? Hey, Mark. Hey, Ben. What's up? How you doing? So far, so good. How about you? You found you some treasures, I see. I heard a rumor once about this bandit resins guy. I don't know anything about him. Have you heard anything, sir? Looks like a horse, don't he? This is Kenny's super starter. Man, I love that grill too. What is that? Some kind of, what mesh is that? Fish cream wire. Wow. <laughs> it's so cool. And just on a super stalker chassis. Wow, that is a quick hit. It's like a Bowman Gray Stadium call. <laughs> How cool is that? I was trying to figure out what to build and I had to look in the box and say, man, I got a swill body here. Oh, love it. Put your hobby knives and that's kind of cool. In his black car, he's been all of them. 32 Ford kids got him in. Did you tell him that? Bell 32 Ford. No, I ain't thought of that. That's what he needs to use. Yeah, he would like that. And that would work. Yeah. Decal, decal. I'm gonna have to go through some books. Go! What's up, well, hey man? guys! What's up? Trying to sell. What you buying? Well, I'm doing a scout <laughs> through right now and filming, so. 